breaking news out of Washington this morning. A lot of handshakes and backpats in the Senate as it passed an historic health care vote. As in the previous two votes, it was along party lines. Jennifer Johnson has details of the vote now. On this morning before Christmas, senators arrived at the Capitol while it was still dark out for this historic vote. After decades of attempts and months and months of debate, the yeas are 60, the nays are 39. Senate Democrats had the votes and approved the health care reform bill. The plan will provide health care coverage for over 30 million Americans. We take that step from health care as a privilege to health care as an inalienable right of every single American citizen. Republicans tried to block passage of this version of the bill, saying it's unconstitutional to require Americans to have health insurance. The Congress, the United States government, has never enacted anything that would regulate someone's inactivity. Unlike the House plan, the Senate's version does not include a government-run insurance program, the so-called public option. But President Obama says that will not warrant a veto from him. Overall, uh, I think that I've seen 95 percent of what will work for the American people. House and Senate leaders will begin working on a compromise bill in the new year. Differences will have to be worked out before one final version of this bill is sent to the president to be signed into law. Jennifer Johnson, NBC News, Washington. Just about 10 minutes ago, the president congratulated senators for their work. He says Congress is close to delivering on a promise to the American people.